We have our UFL playoff picture after week seven coming down to the XFL conference playoff picture. So the St. Louis Battle Hawks with the loss against the Stallions and the Brahmas win with the last second. Uh, they are both tied at five and two. Both teams appear to be strong position to claim the last playoff spot. The D.C. Defenders are now three and four after their loss to the Michigan Panthers, but still alive despite the Arlington Renegades winning the first of the season at one and six. They are eliminated from playoff contention. Even if Arlington won out, best they could do is four and six. The worst the Battle Hawks and Brahmas could do is B5. So defenders take on the Battle Hawks this weekend in a game with playoff ramifications on ABC. It is a must win for D.C. A St. Louis win and a Brahmas win will eliminate D.C. from the playoffs. If they win, they would stay alive for another week. They need a win and a Brahmas loss to the Renegades to really keep pace. So that is the biggest one there. As far as your UFL, USFL conference championship, with the, the conference championship is already set. Birmingham Stallions at Panthers. There's still a shot. The Panthers take on the Showboats at home while the Roughnecks take on the Stallions in Birmingham. A Stallions win will clinch home field advantage for the conference championship game. So there's still things on the line. This weekend, will can the Stallions win? We've seen upsets in the XFL and the USFL in the past. Remember the Pittsburgh Maulers were in the championship game. Is there a possibility of an upset around here somewhere? Maybe, maybe the Houston beats the Stallions, and then you know the Panthers are taking on the Showboats. Uh, you know, could that tra- change some outcomes to make things more interesting as the weeks go by? I hope so, because it's going to be really important, at least for some of these games that. Um, you know, they have some playoff ramifications. But as far as the ratings go, for the most part, people are just watching it because it's football on and sort of getting used to the product. So will be interesting. But there are games on the line. The games matter. All of the games technically matter this weekend. Maybe not so much the week after that, but definitely this weekend, all the games matter in some respect in the UFL.